Hi, my name is Zach Roloff, and I'm here to talk to you about Remco's ProFlow line of pumps today. The first step in troubleshooting with any Remco pump will be to check both the inlet plumbing and verify proper voltage. Remco pumps are self-priming and need to be free of restriction and debris. The most common area for debris to build up is in the inlet strainer or filter. No pump will operate correctly if fittings or hose clamps are not properly tightened. This will ensure proper performance and pump priming. Having the proper voltage is essential to any pump's performance. Remco pumps are rated to run most efficiently on alternator charged 12 volt systems. The standard alternator charge current is between 12 and 14 volts. The lower the voltage you provide to the pump, the lower the performance and output. Proper care and maintenance is vital if you want to maintain a long-lasting, high-performance pump. The best way to take care of the Remco pump is drain, flush, and neutralize, and then store in a warm and dry environment. Sprayer rapid cycling is a common issue. Anytime the flow is either reduced or restricted, most commonly on spot sprayers, you have to simply increase the flow by opening the bypass or agitation line, which returns extra flow into the tank. If you have any other questions, please contact us at sales at remcoindustries.com or visit our website at www.remcoindustries.com.